Hey lovely humans, sorry I know I probably look a bit, well, gross today anyway because, well, I'm sick. Yay, it's that time of the year where there's so many viruses and things going around and I somehow got one. Yay, I hate being sick, like I absolutely despise being sick and I rarely leave the house anyway, I don't know how I got it, like yes my sister was sick the other week and then I went out for a photo shoot and stuff and now... All of a sudden, I have fallen ill. That's probably like you probably can't tell right now because I actually have makeup on. Yay! But yeah, I just somehow got it, and I just feel and look like absolute shite. And it probably sounds like really grumbly right now. I probably have that like, that really deep, sexy voice at the moment. <laughs> oh dear. But yeah, there's heaps going around lately, apparently. And that's the thing. I woke up the other day like feeling slightly sick, like I had a bit of a tickle in the back of my throat, I'm like, oh, I'm probably going to get a cold, I'll be okay, I don't want to hang around anyone at the moment, I'm just really fatigued, woke up the next day and it was a bloody mess, there was just mucus coming out of every orifice and just constant coughing like I'm going to throw up my own lungs and it's just gotten worse from then on, and that's the thing, I'm a very paranoid person, usually, like, I don't know why, I know it's nothing like that could actually happen to me, but I still freak out about it. And I'm like, oh god, I can't breathe because of all this coughing, but I think I've got whooping cough, or I've got AIDS, or I've got something really terminal, and I think I'm going to die constantly. And I had a doctor come over just to make me feel better about myself, saying, no, you are just got a virus. And I was like, oh, thank god, even though I knew it was just a virus. But still, it's just driving me mental and the worst part of it is that I can't sleep I haven't slept properly in days because I wake up every two minutes like coughing everywhere there's just constant tissues everywhere I'm surprised you can't see it's just like piles of tissues all over the bloody place and it's driving me mental <laughs> it's driving me absolutely mental because I love sleep I I would do anything just to sleep but unfortunately during this time there's no way, no way whatsoever, and just, I just don't know what to do about it. Like, usually I drink tea, like, lots of lemon, lemon and ginger tea. I have a lot of garlic, a lot of chilli, just to cleanse your orifices from all the mucus and crap. But I don't have any chilli left, no garlic left, and no tea left. But I got chicken soup, but still, like, I just... Want it to be over. I really do. And the worst part is, like, when I first get things, because of, again, being paranoid, I look up on the internet of, like, my symptoms, which I know you shouldn't do, and I know it's just going to say you're pregnant or you've got cancer constantly. I still look it up, and I'm like, oh, Jesus, I'm going to die and cough my lungs up, and there's going to be blood everywhere, and I'm, it's over. It's over. I'm dead. It's, I just can't take it. I can't take it just living in piles of tissues. And, Usually I don't leave the house and I don't like doing that kind of stuff, but when you're sick, you appreciate it. Like, you appreciate being able to go outside and to be able to take a deep, big deep breath in without sounding like you're dying every five seconds. And I just wish I could be like that just once more. <laughs> Please, just once more. And I feel like I'm going to cough. Anyway, I'm going to go back to bed and probably take a lot of cough syrup if I have any. I hope I have some left. But I hope you guys have a lovely day. Please like and sub if you enjoyed me complaining about sickness, which everybody gets. And I'll see you next time. Have a lovely day.